Hi, I'm Vadim Pogachev, Chief Technology Officer of Biocom Technologies. Our company is a well-known leader in research and development of innovative products and technologies, including software and hardware for health and fitness assessment, physiological research, and biofeedback based on a new science called heart rate variability. Today we will be demonstrating our new professional product called Heart Rhythm Scanner. This product is being used by more than 50 clinical research and educational institutions in the USA and around the world, such as uh, AT State University, East Carolina University, uh, Royal University Hospital, Los Alamos National Laboratory, Stanford University, North Carolina State University, and many others. Uh, many professionals use the heart rhythm scanner in their daily practice to enhance their health assessment techniques and uh, optimize their uh, treatment procedures while others may prefer to use a uh, heart rhythm scanner to obtain more comprehensive assessment of the autonomic nervous system uh, using uh, its built-in testing capabilities which are uh, much wider, more powerful, and extremely accurate. Now we'll show you a new heart rhythm scanner test called the battery reflex sensitivity assessment. Uh, this test records patient's heart rhythm while patient performs deep paced breathing using a special metronome providing 6 breaths per minute rate. It takes only one minute to complete this test. Uh, a special heart rate variability analysis is applied to obtain quantitative uh, information about how strong patient's battery reflex is. Uh, battery reflex is a key mechanism of body's cardiovascular quick adaptation, ensuring optimal blood supply to vital organs. By performing this test regularly, you may get important information about tendencies in patient's cardiovascular regulatory function, whether it remains stable, uh, improving or regressing. This test may be utilized by many healthcare professionals, ranging from general healthcare practitioners to chiropractors naturopaths, uh, nutritionists, weight loss counselors, uh, physical therapists, and many more. This test must be performed while patient sits in a chair in relaxed, slightly reclined position. Uh, the patient should limit body movements, uh, remain silent, and have a neutral state of mind. It is recommended not to take any food caffeine beverages or do exercise for at least two hours prior to this test. To record patient heart rhythm, we use Biocom 4000 ECG recorder connected to PC with USB cable. This test must be performed while patient sits in the chair in a relaxed, slightly reclined position. Uh, the patient should limit body movements remain silent and have a neutral state of mind. It is recommended not to take any food, caffeine, beverages or do exercise for at least two hours prior to the test. To record patient's heart rhythm, we use Biocom 4000 uh, ECG recorder uh, with two ECG electrodes embedded in it and a third electrode on a separate cable. Uh, first of all, we need to put two wrist uh, bands, elastic wrist bands on patient's wrists. Then uh, we need to put uh, ECG device on left wrist underneath uh, elastic wrist band and then put electrode on right uh, wrist underneath the wrist band. Uh, the device is connected to PC with the USB cable. Now we are ready to uh, run the test. First we open the patient record or create a new one if we have a new patient. Here we must input patient name, date of birth and gender to obtain accurate test assessment results. 
then we choose better reflex sensitivity test and start it. Uh, the software begins reading ECG signal from the device, detecting heartbeats and showing them on the screen. A special visual pacer is used to establish right breathing pace and the patient must strictly follow it. Breathe in when the uh, ball goes up and breathe out when it goes down. The uh, patient uh, may try to practice one or two times before we start the test to make sure that the uh, patient's breathing is uh, very synchronous with uh, the spacer. Uh, the software uh, checks the progress of, of the test and indicates it on uh, the progress uh, bar below the screen showing elapsed time and time left. Uh, once the test is over, the software automatically uh, saves test results. Uh, besides that, uh, the software evaluates the quality of uh, recorded taste data and indicates uh, if the data, uh, data quality is sufficient, like here. Uh, this is the better reflex sensitivity assessment report. It shows patient personal information, test data quality information, and it shows the results of heart rate variability analysis. Below, uh, this uh, report indicates a heart rate graph that recorded during the test, the power spectrum graph, which indicates if data recording and, and test was uh, completed in compliance with test requirements. To make sure that it is compliant, the high peak on this spectrum lies within the narrow frequency band, like here. On the side of it, the report shows a scatter graph. The key part of the report is very reflex sensitivity chart used to evaluate current level of better reflex regulatory capability. The higher it is, the more cardiovascular system is capable to efficiently adapt to changes of the body function. Below is the verbal interpretation of the cardiovascular functional condition showing uh, prevailing heart rhythm, rhythm disturbances, functional condition and recommendation. This was a presentation of the better reflex sensitivity assessment test. Next time we will show you different scenarios of using the heart rhythm scanner in practice. Thank you for watching this video and we will see you next time.